It's Chris and Nesbitt in the morning. <laughs> this is going really well. This is going great. <laughs> Good morning. Oh, hello. <laughs> yeah, that's that's how you're starting it. That's... <laughs> Why doesn't it stick? It's being a bee. You're being a bee. It's rude. You're not. Your face is being a bee. <laughs> okay. Okay. okay, so do you want to go? I'll go, let me go first with my thing that I want. What are you doing today? Oh, I don't want to tell you. What? What does that mean? <laughs> you remember how we talked about Taylor Swift a little bit in the car the last time? Sure. So I thought we could talk about that. Okay. Because that's like a big story, right? Now. So like her breakup with Calvin Harris and how she's now all of a sudden dating this um, Tom Hiddleston guy. <laughs> this is safe. Like I was saying, Taylor like you were Swift, saying. Tom Hiddleston, Calvin Harris posted on his Twitter right around where they broke up and he was like the reality is that it's a breakup it happens there's still lots of love between us and like la 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 but then took it down and said another tweet that said like shit's about to go down and then like she dated him like like, like she dated him like a month or something after or very quick the tom guy yeah yeah it was like a week after or something like that good for her after we all <laughs> i mean it's taylor swift right <laughs> that's on how long some. this one's gonna last he's not one he's album not, one album. <laughs> her next album is like is like is gonna be called Calvin, I'm sure. And her, now she's got a new one. one. Yeah, she's oh. like, I need a new boyfriend so that I can talk about <laughs> how he was an, also a dick. I'm sorry, going from Calvin Harris to Tom. Have you seen what these guys look like? Um, I've heard what these guys sound like. So Calvin Harris is like I know a fox. Calvin Harris. Okay. Oh, is a fox? And Tom is not. Are we talking about foxes as in like as in like, like he's, he's old and gray? Dude. No, 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 he's a good looking dude. Okay, he's a good looking guy, and the other guy's not. <laughs> no. What Although if... he's like a super villain in those movies, so that I get how that could be attractive. Who the hell is this guy? You need to look it up. I guess I do. I think he's. Oh fuck! He's in a like. Oh, can I say that? It's you two. I That's think you cool. can see whatever you want. <laughs> He's like the villain in either Star Wars or maybe... Oh my god, is he the guy? Is he like Han Solo's kid and he kills no, him? No, he's... That's... Ew. That's the other guy? Oh, he's awful. Maybe Star Trek? Or like in... What's that other movie where they're like in space and there's like a guy that's like kind of made of stone or something? The Fantastic Four? What if Calvin Harris is just like a huge dick behind the scenes and she was in an abusive relationship? We're not going to know oh, until her new though. album. Hang on though. It sounds like it ended pretty amicably until oh, okay. Taylor Swift was like, yo, I'm dating this other guy two days after I was dating you. Because that are whole you say, tweet are you situation. Saying you, are you saying that you think maybe she cheated on, she cheated on him? Mm, either she cheated on him or Because like maybe, maybe they broke up and then she's like, she and him are like, okay, we're breaking up. It's fine. And then two days later, she's like, oh, by the way, I'm going to go out with this other guy. And he's I mean, like, she what probably... the fuck? Yeah, exactly. So that's that's my celebrity gossip okay. for the day. So, Pet, How three, three months, last? six months, a year, or, or more? Okay, so Calvin Harris lasted like... Two years, three years, five years, seven years. I think he lasted like a year. Oh. Or like a little bit more than a year, which is like a pretty big record for Taylor Swift. To be I'm, calling, I'm calling six months to a year. I'm going to say three months. I think he's a rebound. Okay. Okay. Chris is sick, man! Yes. <laughs> Question. Okay. You have a blind friend. Yes. And magically, you can make him see again. Whoa, where what did is... you find this question? You make this up in your mind? What is no. It? Okay. Go. What is the first thing that you would show him? You put him somewhere and then you're like, boop. Okay, I have a question. Okay, I have a question. First. Has he I do the questions! <laughs> <laughs> Has he ever seen it in his life? No, he's blind. He's been blind for since birth. Sure. What's the point of having well, someone sure. who used to be able to see, see something? You're like, oh, I can now see. Well, maybe they forgot about again. what looking is like. I don't know. Another question. What? What this is his personality question. like? You can't just say like. What is his personality do like? Do I know what his personality is like? Maybe I don't care. <laughs> Okay. You know nothing about this person. Okay. They open this door, there's a blind person, and the cops are like, listen, we hear you have magical powers, you can make blind people see. This guy's blind, you need to take him somewhere and show him something for the first time. Okay, then I would take him to the top of a mountain range in Vancouver, and I would be like, see, that's me. The if I knew the tops? person, it would be a different story. Well, different yeah, story. I, I guess it would, but it, maybe, I don't know. It'd be really cool to take him to like, or this person to 
uh, the top of a mountain, okay. facing the ocean, okay. at like four in, the, four in the morning, in the dark, so they can see the stars, but it's not too like crazy yet. Oh, that's a way more. And then they get to see the sunrise. See, then they see, they, 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 he's like, oh my God, the sunrise, and the colors, and the reds, and the oranges, and then he's like, what the fuck is that? And I'm like, that's called the ocean. <laughs> Like he doesn't know what an ocean well, is. Wouldn't, well, who, he'd be like, "What is that? What is?" Oh, I, that's right. Because he wouldn't blind. know what an ocean is. But he's, I'm sure he's been. It's been described before. Yeah, but like, like you could describe it, but like, how do you really describe an ocean? Mm. There, you see, a large you feel, of water. you feel this. There's just like a bunch of this all over the place. This everywhere. There's so <laughs> much of it that it makes waves. How do I describe a wave? Um, you show them the ocean. And he's like, what is this? And you're like, it's the ocean. And he's like, what is that? And you're like, that is a homeless man pooping. <laughs> More news. Okay. Today yes. is Braxton. Braxton? Brixton? Bra okay, what's, what is the context? Today, Britain gets to decide and vote whether or not they want to stay in the EAU. In That's... The EU. Okay, I don't know EU. enough about this to really talk about it, but like, what's the advantage of not being in the EU? I think the idea is that... The, is that they think that they send a lot of money to, to the EU and they don't get enough, they don't get ben oh, enough benefits. is that, ben the, is that the, the thing? benefits back. Okay. Everyone that I've talked to, which is all one person about this. <laughs> John he, Oliver. He was from, <laughs> I, I, <laughs> he said that he, it would suck, right? Like yes. it would suck. For, okay. I feel like it sucks for the individual, but maybe for the country it's better. I don't know. What do you predict? Because this is one of those, Taylor Swift might not be for a year and you know, hopefully <laughs> it's not for a year because then I'll win, but. Well, this is tomorrow. Know about this? tomorrow. Will we actually know tomorrow? Yeah, we should know by tomorrow. Okay, I'm gonna predict that it stays part of the EU. I don't think they'll separate, but for the sake of argument, so that tomorrow somebody there's a clear winner and loser. Oh, so you're saying that they're going we can't to. both be losers. Well. Oh. So the other thing that I want to talk to you about, I've been listening to this podcast, Jenny, Jenna and Julian. Do you know? Do you watch Jenna Marbles? Yeah, absolutely. It's my favorite Hilarious. show. <laughs> is that where we're going with this? Yeah, that's exactly <laughs> where we're going with this. Okay. You knew. Uh, you knew the answer to that question as soon as you said it. Okay, so I've been watching this, This no, not watching, I've been listening, listening. to this podcast, okay. and they had a Survivor contestant on, the last one, and it was super interesting. I, I almost never watched Survivor, and I feel like the only people that watch Survivor right now are, like, diehards, right? Yeah, it's like, true, Priya. nobody watches it anymore. Yeah, nobody watches it anymore. <laughs> no. So... Shout like, out to Priya! Yeah, Priya! <laughs> She's never gonna watch this. No, she... Well, maybe we'll force her. It'll <laughs> be fine. One of the upcoming Survivors is gonna be Millennials versus, like, Generation X. Okay. Is that not cool? That's kind of interesting. Like, I almost want to watch that one. I feel like it'll be... I think a lot of people are going to think that millennials are going to be like... Are, are just going to be like, oh, we're so entitled to everything in the world. Well, but they're going to be like the opposite. It could thing. go either way because there, there are different types of millennials, right? Well, they're, they're, there's like the selfie. Yeah, and the then there's ones. like the entrepreneur. I, I feel like know. there's a lot of a lot of millennials that have to work twice as hard to get the same things that other I to, generations I totally, get. I so. totally agree. Did you clean this car for... Um, for the show? How dare you? That's not lazy at all. How dare you? That's, that's is it dirty? No. I wonder if they can see my back seat. <laughs> you can't see, but are these Cheetos? It's so clean. This... Stop! <laughs> There's no Cheeto. Did you get Cheeto on my seat? First. You can go. First and only. You can go. No, oh, don't do that. Too late. I already did. See, and we're moving now. You're welcome. We're almost <laughs> at work. Yes. How do you think our first show went? I'm actually super pleased with. How that went. Were you nervous? Were you nervous? No. You no, you weren't nervous the, as, as the, I mean at the start, yeah. Okay. That because that was awkward. Wait, 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 are you ready for this? Yeah, that's right. Get off the road, douchebag! <laughs> We're so fun. <laughs> uh, Dan, we mentioned you in this video. You should probably yeah, you need watch, to watch it. The show as well. <laughs> You're gonna have to edit some stuff up though, I think. Right? Oh god, yes. This is awkward. That's gonna be our theme song now. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to see your um, your intro. I'll put it on my, my phone too. What did you What did you do for like the visual part of it? Kinetic type typography. What does that mean? It means that this show is over. Hey. Get Kristen has been in the morning. morning.